So this piece will now go where, and remember the push button is still inside the arm. That's important. It's kind of the shoulder of the puppet. And I just put that disc over the black part of uh, the black tube. And now I would put glue on that white disc where it attaches to the fa where I'm going to push it against the fabric. Okay, so I've put contact cement or epoxy. You can use either epoxy or contact cement inside the black part here, the black um, hat where it touches the fabric, and you would put white glue where it's going to touch the fabric inside on the white disc. Again, contact cement or epoxy, whatever works and you just let it dry and it holds very well after it dries you would take stuffing and really stuff the shoulder pretty tight to keep the mechanism from wobbling around you don't want it to wobble you want it to be a very tight tight fit so you'd stick stuffing all around underneath it and really not too tight but you know really tight so it's not wobbly like it is right now you want a nice tight fit and then I would just sew it and finish off the arm and so as I showed you earlier the completed arm I finished it off by sewing it I've stuffed the arm pretty heavily so there's a lot of reinforcement and now you can release it and um, have it come back. Uh, you can release it and uh, push on it to release it and it goes on. And there we go. And it's great. You've got full mobility of the arm. There's no restriction. It's not going to go anywhere. It's not going to come off at all during a show. And um, you can't see it which is awesome and when you need to switch clothing quickly like I said if you need instead of making so many arms all the time you can use a different puppet and switch arms out it's just many different uses and your imagination is up to you and you could probably apply it to many different things in the puppetry area so I can take some questions if some anybody has any questions but that's what it is Are there any questions concerning this before I stop taping? Yeah, it is pretty straightforward once you see. And you know, if you don't find these little black pieces, oh. I I don't think you do, Sean. I've had no problems. I've really tugged at this on the side that's glued. And I'll tell you, it's going to take a lot to pull this thing out a lot so I don't see an issue if if you're using um, epoxy to glue it on sure if you think that you can if you want to do that you can definitely do that to reinforce it no doubt yeah you could probably use it for legs as well absolutely yeah facial features it might be challenging Oh, the contact cement I use, I don't think you can get in America. It's the uh, green. It's the safe, 100% natural stuff. It's not easy to find in America, so I have been told. Yeah, it's a water base, but I love it. Mixed reviews from other people, but I find it takes a little longer to um, get tacky, but worth it because I can use it in my house. I <laughs> just ordered, yeah, that's right. Yeah, I could use, yes, that's right. Oh, okay, you can use it to, that's right. Sorry, I misread your question. It's to glue this, the black piece against the fabric and uh, the, the, the wheel, the, the, the white um, hinge piece for doll hinges to glue that against the fabric.
that's all. Yeah, that's true. Sure, I'll show the keychain again. This is the keychain. You can buy them in packages or just on their own. I find them at dollar stores for a buck each. Uh, I found them at hardware stores. Yes, after you glue this mechanism in, because you don't want the stuffing to be in the way, you have to glue this, place it in, and then stuff it really tight to where you want it, and then finish off the arm. Because you got to leave the top open to put everything in. Oh, yes, you, you, you came in a bit later, but th yes, that's what it is, one of those. You just get rid of these rings. That's all. So that is it. It looks like I've answered all the questions. I hope you enjoy this video. I hope it becomes useful. And um, it's something very different, but I see a lot of possibilities with it.